Imagine waking up with a smile on your face, a spring in your step, and a heart full of joy, even amidst the chaos of life. Sounds impossible? Not when you learn to handle stress in God's way. Today, we're diving into a tranquil sea of faith, exploring how divine wisdom can transform our everyday stress into serenity. Picture a life where stress is not a monster, but a molehill. Intrigued? Stay tuned as we unravel how to turn those mountains of stress into molehills of joy. We all have a monster living within us. It's called stress. It gnaws at our peace, robs us of joy, and leaves us feeling drained. This monster, this stress, is a master of disguise. It can creep up on us under the guise of a looming deadline, an argument with a loved one, or even the simple uncertainty of what tomorrow may bring. It's an unwelcome intruder that wreaks havoc on our physical health, causing headaches, sleep problems, and even heart disease. It toys with our mental well-being, leading us down the path of anxiety, depression, and burnout. It slithers its way into our relationships, causing friction and misunderstandings. It's a monster that seems invincible, but it's not. There's a secret weapon, a divine tool that can help us slay this monster. But what if I told you that there's a secret weapon to slay this monster, and that weapon is right within your reach? The secret weapon is God's word. Through it, he provides us with an armor to not just fight, but conquer stress. This divine armor is comprised of simple yet powerful verses that guide us through life's turbulent times. Consider the verse from the book of Psalms, cast your burdens onto the Lord and he will sustain you. This verse serves as a comforting reminder that we are not alone in our struggles. We have a divine ally who is willing and able to carry our burdens. Next, we have be still and know that I am God from Psalms again. This verse encourages us to pause, take a breath, and recognize the presence of God amidst the chaos. It's a call to surrender our worries and trust in His divine plan. Lastly, there's a profound verse from the book of Philippians. Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. This verse guides us to replace our anxiety with prayer, effectively transforming our worries into requests for divine intervention. These verses serve as a reassuring shield of faith a helmet of salvation, and a sword of the Spirit, equipping us with the strength to navigate through life's stressful situations. With these verses as our shield and sword, we are well equipped to face the stress monster. But how do we actually apply these in our daily lives? It's one thing to know the verses, another to apply them. But fear not, for it's simpler than you think. Stress is a part of life that we all deal with, but we don't have to let it control us. The Bible provides us with wisdom and guidance that can help us manage our stress in a healthy and constructive way. One of the easiest ways to incorporate this divine wisdom into our daily lives is through prayer. When you're feeling overwhelmed, take a moment to pause and speak to God. Share your worries, ask for strength, and express gratitude for the blessings in your life. This simple act of faith can provide a sense of peace and calm, helping to reduce your stress levels. Meditation is another powerful tool. You might choose to meditate on a particular verse, contemplating its meaning and how it applies to your life. This practice can help you to focus your mind, quiet your thoughts, and find tranquility in the midst of chaos. Engaging in faith activities can also be beneficial. This might include attending a Bible study group, volunteering at a local charity, or simply spending time in nature, marveling at God's creation. These activities can provide a sense of purpose and fulfillment, helping to combat feelings of stress. By applying these in your daily life, you will soon find the stress monster shrinking and your joy growing. Life is a journey filled with ups and downs. Stress is a part of that journey, but it doesn't have to rule your life. We've talked about recognizing the stress monster, donning the divine armor, and applying these truths in our daily lives. With faith, hope, and God's word, we can tackle stress head on. Remember, with God's word in your heart and his strength in your soul, you are more than capable to handle whatever comes your way. Here's to a stress-free life.